You know, I'm not used to being able to relax with anybody. This motherfucker just walked into my life. Unexpectedly. But I feel like I wrote him in my life or something. I, I prophesized about him and then he just shows up. It was a fantasy, and now it's reality. But it's always in God's timing, it's never in your timing. So I find it really interesting how... This is happening like when it feels like the world's about to be over. If you've been watching this channel consistently, thank you. Thank you for giving a fuck about me. I don't expect anybody to like me or love me or appreciate me or want me around. I don't expect that. And it scares me whenever people do. Because I just assume that they'll leave. I assume that eventually they'll get sick of me and reject me. So maybe I'm paranoid about that. Or I'm insecure because it's just happened so many times. And if it doesn't, then I'll prophesize about it until it does. I don't know, man. It really is like an acid trip, isn't it? I guess this is the bad strip of acid. Sometimes it's a lot of fun. I mean, y'all have seen me when I'm laughing and cutting up and... Because I really do crack myself up. I think I should do crowd work from now on. I haven't wanted to do crowd work because I'm always in my own little world, but I'm realizing that I probably should do it because I don't want to do it. <laughs> so maybe the reason why I don't want to do it is because I would be good at it or because it's what I'm supposed to do, you know. I don't know. I can't believe that I did a whole hour tonight. Like, that's crazy. 